Plus Spotlight. As you can see from their warm-up shirts, the Dominican Knights are indeed back for more. The Knights go after their fourth consecutive Division IV state championship after defeating their state semifinal opponent by 39 points. The Knights dispatched of previously unbeaten Eau Claire Regis in the semis. In the championship contest, they face another unbeaten squad, Mineral Point. Sharpshooting Cy Staver hit a couple of three-pointers in the second quarter, each time drawing the pointers within four points. But Dominican led by seven at the half, and they build upon that when Diamond Stone makes a soft touch pass to Garrison Good. Mineral Point calls timeout because Dominican has doubled its lead to 14 just a couple of minutes into the third quarter. Right out of the timeout, Taiwan Bressler Jr. comes up with the steal. He'll leave it for Garrison Good, and that's easy if you're tall and athletic like he is. Bressler had nine assists, Good one of four Knights scoring in double figures. Defensively, the Knights have shot blockers like Kostas Ateto Kunpo, who had three rejections on the night. The brother of the young Milwaukee Buck, and Ted Okunpo can take it to the rack and score as well. Dominican fans can look forward to seeing him again next year, and they get two more years of this guy, Jake Bennett, who makes it look easy going to the rack. Next possession, in transition, it's Jake Bennett again, this time for three, Dominican clearly rolling to its fourth straight title. Then it's Austin Mutri to Diamond Stone. The All-American Stone had 23 points and 15 rebounds in this one. And when he's double or triple teamed, he finds the open man, in this case, Garrison Good. The Knights are about to finish this one off. And here is the way to do it. Diamond Stone throwing down the rock. Dominican wins it 75-49 to finish the season with a 25-3 record. In Diamond Stone's four years, Dominican racked up 101 wins against just 11 defeats. The Knights become just the second team to win four consecutive WIAA state championships. People run the city, people run the stage, think it's just me. It's Diamond Stone and Dominican, but it's, you know, Dominican as a whole. And I think um, that shocks a lot of teams and people because we have so many weapons. Usually we tell him, like, you don't have to do this all by yourself. Like, we can help you. And he knows that. He, he Like, he's, he's built trust over the last three years with us uh, as a team. So I think, he, um, I, think, I think he took a big step in trusting us, too, and saying that we can help him when uh, reaches go. And now to be a part of this Wisconsin hi history books here, you know, the second team ever to win the four in a row is kind of, you know, you got to kind of pinch yourself a little bit here to believe it's real. Now to the D5 championship game. We met Taiwan Jones and Young Cogs prep earlier in the show. They're taking on Hillsborough for the crown. Second quarter, Jones called for the charge. He'd spend time on the bench with four fouls. And second leading scorer, Jonte Peterson, had gone out earlier with an injury. But the Eagles stayed strong. D'Angelo Crawford wraps the pass around to freshman Yoshiri Brown. Young Cogs up 11 in the third. A little later, that same pair hooks up again. Crawford five assists to go along with 20 points. Then Taiwan Jones back on the court, soft touch. It would be the Eagles' only fourth quarter field goal. Max Stockwell scored a game high 28. His bucket brought Hillsborough within four with just over a minute left. But the Eagles would make just enough of their free throws late and they hold on for the 56-50 triumph. Young Cogs Prep celebrates its first state championship. The Eagles say anyone who doubted them was just motivating them more. Our game plan was to push the ball, but they actually got back uh, pretty well. Uh, and they were just super strong, strongest team we faced all year. So uh, it was a battle. It feels good because, once again, nobody believed us. Right. But I'm pretty sure they're believing us now. It helped us. And it's going to help us take, our, take ourselves far in life. It's something we'll never forget.